Hi, I'm Amy from Doodle Blog Designs, and today I'm going to show you how to make these felted wool lavender flower stems. Let's get started. I have some purple felted wool and some green felted wool. You could also use felt. I cut a piece of the purple wool two inches wide, and this one is seven inches long. And I'm going to fold it in half lengthwise, and then I'm going to run some hot glue along the edge. You could also stitch it if you prefer. Then you want to cut little slits into the fabric up to the glue edge. I'm cutting mine about a fourth of an inch apart. You can experiment with different widths of cuts to see what type of look you like. Now for the stem you could use a skewer stick or a dowel rod or a floral stem if you have it. I'm going to take this long floral stem and fold it in half and twist it a little bit to give it a little bit more substance and that's what I'm going to use. I like to use the floral stems because I can bend them around and manipulate them in my flower bouquet. The hardest part is getting started. Just want to put a little bit of the glue on the edge and wrap this wool around and glue it onto itself and then start wrapping. The closer you wrap each layer to the next layer, so if you wrap like here, it's going to be a fuller flower than if you were to take it down and wrap it more like at this angle. So you're in control of how full the flower ends up being. You can also change the look of the flower by using different widths of wool and cutting different widths of loops. I'm just holding the wool still and I'm twisting the stem at this point. Just twisting the flower around and around. You can add some leaves at the bottom if you want. I'm just going to take this green felted wool and cut out a leaf shape. And I'm going to hot glue it right here.
the leaves for this one I've made a little bit wider than the first one. I'm gonna see how that looks. Fast and easy to make these, and they make a really cute addition to your spring and summer decorating. Thanks for watching. Be sure to click the like button and subscribe below. I'll see you next time. Bye.